All right, high school national record. How's that feel? It has not sunk in at all yet. I feel like it's just been so like hectic after finishing and going to all the stations and I haven't really been able to just sit down and just like realize what I did. Um, yeah, it means a lot though. <laughs> I got, the, uh, I got the chance to talk to your dad before this, oh, yeah. and he told me about the conversation the two of you guys had at the practice field. Do you want to let people know, I guess, a little bit of what he, he told you about before this race? Yeah, I mean, he was just really telling me that I'm ready. Um, a lot of times I tend to, you know, kind of doubt a lot more in myself, but, you know, my parents are always there, just, like, believing in me, so, you know, he was just saying, like, reminding me of all the workouts that I had done, um, and just, like, where I am, and... Um, just like yeah pretty much believing in myself um, when I didn't really believe in myself so it helped a ton. So can you take us through sort of the race a little bit because you know the stands were not you know not filled it was for, you know fairly empty I would say for the most part for this race so it was just kind of like an expected battle between the two of you and the two of you decided to make it really fast. Yeah yeah it was definitely you know a change from the trials last year like walking out last year and the stadium being pretty packed um, and this year being a little more empty um, but honestly it was kind of nice just kept the pressure off of it and yeah I mean Roshin and I really just like wanted to go out there and just you know do our best um, you know obviously having the top two spots is like our goals but you know also you know trying to make you know use of us being in the same race together so we can really pull along pull each other along to get like a fast time so I'm always honored to race Roshin because she's an incredible athlete and it's always nice being friends with her too. <laughs> when you cross the finish line did you know you had it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, when I crossed, I knew it, and then I turn around, look at the board, see Roisin there, and I was just so happy. I had been replaying that moment kind of, you know, in my head for the past, like, week or so, so for it to come true was just such a dream. It kind of makes all those frustrations you had when you were stuck at 201, like, kind of now be like, oh, I mean, like, Dad had a point. <laughs> yes, it's so worth it, honestly. That, like, weight, just, like, I think it showed how much I wanted it more if I feel like if I had run, you know, not as many of those 201s and I just jumped straight away to, like, sub two or even two flat, I feel like I wouldn't have, you know, been, like, as proud as, my, as, proud of myself for, like, what I had come through and also just, like, excited about what t that time really means to me. Um, so I feel like that weight and just, like, kind of frustration, like, it, the, these times are just making it so worth it. What's it like making a team with Roisin? So good. Like, it's kind of crazy because we're going to college, obviously, together in the next few months, so we'll be together 24-7. But we have been wanting to make this team together, um, and I just really could not have imagined making it with anyone else, um, and I'm just so excited. Roommates, or you don't know yet? Uh, unfortunately for college at Stanford, you're not a lot of room with people in the same team as you, so unfortunately not, but hopefully maybe in like sophomore or junior year we'll be. <laughs> Your dad told me a little bit of just like how relaxed you guys took yesterday of just like chilling out. So what was it the two of you did together yesterday to get ready for this? Yeah, I mean we both kind of did our pre -me on our own and then Rasheen came over to our Airbnb and we watched a movie and just kind of chilled on the couch and did literally nothing, which is honestly just such a good like relaxing like kind of moment to just kind of take a step away from like all the you know hectic you know thoughts of racing and just kind of enjoy just like hanging out and not thinking about the race like all day yesterday um and i think it really just like made us get for focus to for today and not be like so drained and like um tired and so roshin said you guys are thinking medals and possibly one too yeah that would be awesome that that's the plan we'll see but yeah that'd be so cool Awesome. Juliet, well, congratulations. Wishing you all the best. Thank and, you. Uh, now you're forever going to be on these heat sheets all across the country. <laughs> yeah, so insane. <laughs>